Oh my god. No! Oh! Oh no! No, no! I never snipe and I find- Oh! Oh my heart! I would've repaid for my Travis Kelsey. I hate this game. On video. For cheap, fast, and reliable coins, make sure to head on over to CoinBank UT and make sure to use code Poodle at checkout for 15% off. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, and today we're gone sniping filters, I believe number 21. So, we actually just recorded this video, and the audio was on, the mic was off, so gotta record it again. So, hopefully, this one's on. I hope you guys can hear me. So, I actually just sniped the Travis Kelsey out, finally. I've been waiting for this one for I've been waiting for this one for like since since it came out yesterday, but I didn't want to spend 550k on it like I was about to, so I waited. I just sniped it out for about 450. So you see him on the right, kind of he's a beast. He's really really good with cams and everything. So hopefully he plays well for me on weekend league. I will be testing him out on stream today. So if you haven't already, go over to Twitch now and drop the follow down below. Follow me on Twitch. We will be twitching today. We twitch about five days a week. Very fun time. We just hit affiliate status today, which is crazy. Not only our first few streams actually. So thank you guys so much for that. So let's get to the uh, let's get to the sniping. So if you look here, these cards are right down to 475. The MVPs are dropping. So, like I said before, you have two options. So, option number one, you buy now, and you hope that when the combine drops, there's really good sets for scouts, and these players go up in price, and you resell, and you make a profit. Or that's that's the riskiest way because they could also go down. So now, here's the the safest option: you wait till the combine drops. Usually, they don't drop their best stuff right away. So you wait till the combine drops, and the scout sets suck and these players were up in anticipation so they go down a lot so like maybe 390 415 and then what you do is when it draw when um when it, you buy those cards and then in a week or so when they drop good good things for scouts like nat nat um combine players nat uh, combine packs something then you go and these cards should go back up to 475 500 and then you resell so that's, that's, that's the safest option in my opinion you buy when they're really cheap they're at their cheapest that's the safest option now what you want to do is up to you because it's a riskier one, which is buy now and hope that was, you know, you wouldn't have a chance to buy low again. This is the lowest they'll get, or you think they'll get lower and you wait. It all depends on what they drop. I can't, I can't foresee that future. So now the best thing to snipe as it's been for the majority of this month, but especially today, especially today, if you guys have already go on over to the ultimate legends right now, you're missing out. If you're not sniping ultimate legends today, look how crazy this is. 290 for Javon Curse, 290 for Everson Wall, uh, Walls, Morton Anderson 295, Mike Allstar 298. So like if we, if we filter out by let's say Chargers, 295, 295. I just saw Kellen Winslow before for 260 on the other video and I didn't, I didn't get it. I thought I'd know it was a snipe. I was like maybe they're just that low. So if you haven't already, start sniping these now. They're crazy cheap. Javon Curse 280. They just keep going down. And now if you look at the more the better uh, the the good ones, Calvin for 400k. I'll resell that later. I didn't get it. Okay. Well, you see the point. Calvin for 400k. He'll go back up to like 480 tonight. So I recommend you hop on that. You got to be getting these Ultimate Legends right now. Let's see what else there is. Um, Kevin Green, 285. Not a snipe, but it's a good price to keep. And if you want to snipe, you want to get it for like 260. But to keep right now, if you want to keep any Ultimate Legends right now is the time. I personally want this Mike Allstar. I hit half back, but you can still check it out. I want Mike Allstott, and I want... Um, who's the other guy I wanted? I can't remember. But it's like a lot of these cards won't fit on my team anymore because my team's already surpassed that. And overall, like, a lot of my players are already, like, 99s, 98s. But Romanowski, you guys want to be here right now. If you don't have the coins, I'll, I'll show you guys another one for lower people, but... This is where the money's at right now. And then, because this is Ultimate Legend Saturday. So you guys want to be getting these right now. Oh, my God. No! Oh! Oh no! No, no! I never snipe and I find. Oh! Oh my heart! I would have repaid for my Travis Kelsey. I hate this game. On video. Oh, I thought I said I got it. My heart. Oh, that one hurts. 
That hurts a lot. Damn. Oh. Now I'm sad. It's the video, guys. I'm out. Just kidding. I gotta finish this, but... Oh my god, I would've paid all my... I would've given my million coins back. But you get the point. Come snipe. Come snipe, guys. This is a filter to be on. Oh my god. I'm depressed. Damn. I could even use them. I could have put my backup tight end for that price. That was free. That was literally a free, free Kellen Winslow. All right, guys. So, obviously, the odds of you finding a 251 are not that high. But, still recommend you try it. And if not, maybe get like a 150. You still get some pretty good ones. So, I can find you guys another one on stream. On video, I keep saying stream. Oh, my God. All right, let's see. Let me go to the lower ones for you guys, for those of you who have been waiting. So, let's see. So, if you can't afford these, next best ones are right here. 94s. Not as profitable as the other ones. You can get these for like maybe 90K or 100K and you resell for 120, make like a quick 10K. These are pretty good. These are really cheap too. And then the lower ones would be... Let's look at these. These aren't that profitable. If you want, you want to get these for like 10 to 12k, make a quick 5k every time, and at that rate, you can make like 100k every hour. Or so, if you do this properly and you're getting, the, you know, it's hot. It's hot right now, so I recommend the packs are out. If you're gonna do it now, it'll be the time to do it. Now let's see back to these because I want to snipe now. All right, this doesn't look like it's gonna happen. So, you know what? I'm not gonna waste your time with that. So, let me go show you guys the sets real quick. I'll tell you what I think if they're profitable or not. Personally, I'm not a fan of some of them. One seems okay. Oh, I passed that because I was distracted, didn't I? Yep, it was like the first one. All right, so random ultimate legend exchange player. So these are not worth it because these require a 94 overall. So let's say 120k. Let's go. You said for 120, 120, 120. That is 360, and all you get is 197 overall plus. So even if you pull Calvin, Sean, let's say you pull Sean Taylor, like the set, the best one, the second best one. You still will lose on the reduction. You still make like 5k. So like, even if you get the best pull, you you barely make like the only way sets like this are worth it if the best pull makes you like 400k. But it doesn't. The best pull makes you like 10k. So stay away from the set. Odds are you pull like a Kevin Green or one of them and you just lose 80k. This one doesn't seem too bad actually. So these these are about 20k a piece. Let's say you get them. Let's you can probably sign for 18k each. So 18k times eight is about like maybe 140 ish. So these are 140 and a 94 overall goes for 120. So like you can make you at worst, if you get a 94, you lose. But if you get a 95 or you get like a 97, you make a good amount of coins or 98. So, but this is probably why they only let you do it once. You can only do it once a week. So I recommend that maybe you do this one. This one doesn't sound bad. And this one's the same. This is the tokens. These don't really matter. These are for whenever you get it. I'm personally not doing it because I saw a good point on Twitter. Some guy was like, thank, like, thank you, Madden. Like you're going to, you're giving us a free 98 overall player in April. And he's right, like, right now, these players are already going for 280k. By the time it comes to April, those cars will be, like, probably 115. They'll be going for dirt cheap. So, like, for me, it wouldn't be worth it. For you guys, sure, but I'm not playing those full solos every day. I'm wasting my time that I could be spending on YouTube and streaming and doing some productive stuff for myself, at least. Let me open up a pack, see if I can pull one of these guys real quick. Deion Sims. Nope. 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 Okay. Trying to save up coins right now. I'm currently like 11 and 2 on weekend league. Hopefully, I can hit. Um, hopefully, top 100 this week. That's the goal. Top 100 is the goal. I'm hoping. I hope. I'll, right now, I'm on pace for 23 and 2, but we both know that's not gonna happen. So maybe 19 and 6. That's what I'm hoping for. So more so, maybe 25. But we'll see. I'll keep you guys updated on Twitter on that one. Also, make sure you're doing your daily sets. Make sure you're leveling up. These pack. I'm gonna get this ultimate legend pack, and hopefully, hopefully get some good out of it. I'm praying. Now. Make sure you're playing online games too. You get so many trophies. You can use these trophies. If you complete all of these, and you don't, even if you're in a low season, just complete them. If you complete them, you have enough trophies to get a John Madden like twice. If you do all these and you play all the, all season and you win, you can get a John Madden probably twice. And you could use that to literally get like a million coins off John Madden. It's so worth it. Now, make sure you're doing the Shazier stuff too. The Shazier stuff's easy coins, 15,000, 20,000. And just for playing the game, you're also getting coins. If you look at these, these mud level things, every time you hit a certain, like, one of these little brackets that it shows you, you get a lot of coins. Like, sometimes I'll get out of a game, and it's, like, 30K for adding to your offensive uh, yards. 
It's like, obviously, I'm at a lot. I have 230,000 yards, which probably isn't a lot to some people, but it's probably a lot to some others. Points scored, I'm almost at 40,000. 15K touchdowns, I'm almost at... I just hit my... Yeah, I just hit that not too long ago. So, that's about it for this video, guys. I've pretty much showed you everything. Uh, let me show you this Travis Kelsey real quick. Before I head on out of here, if you guys are still here. Also, I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit, so while I'm at it, so... Go over to Twitch, drop the follow. We are 53 followers, like I said earlier. We're really grinding on that right now. Trying to make a community over there and on here. Well, I'm not trying to I'm not trying to separate them like some people do. I'm not a, I'm not a Twitch streamer, I'm not a YouTuber. I'm a content creator of Madden. I'm a community person, so I'm mixing it all together. My Twitter, my YouTube, and Twitch. They all combine for one. So I'm hoping that I can create a ma one massive community. And I'm working on it pretty well. So I got like 238 subs here. Like 400 followers on Twitter and about like 53 followers on Twitch and together. It's a pretty big community. I'm starting to get some leverage in the community now. I'm loving it. It's really fun. People are listening to me, taking my advice. It's been a fun time and a good journey. Before I continue, let me get to this Kelsey. So this Kelsey's got a 93 speed. Pretty fast. No George Kittle, but he's up there. 88 strength, 97 catch, 98 catch in traffic, 99 spec catch, 95 short round running, 91 medium route, and 84 run block. What's also impressive is his jumping for a, for a six foot five guy. He's had 95 jumping, so he will be up there with the best of them when it comes to those high points. 99 spec and 95 jumping, so he's going to be a beast along Calvin and Randy Moss. Going to be a big boy out there. Now, as far as the overall, I don't know why it's not a 98 yet. I'm going to go check, actually, because maybe it's just my punter that I need. Because, honestly, I need, maybe I need one more lineman. I always thought it was a tight end. Let's see. No, okay, I need one more. I need probably another lineman. All right, so first off, I need you guys to comment down below what you guys want to see on my team. By the way, oh, what do you guys want to see? Well, first on my team, yeah, if you guys know what my team looks like already, I'll go over there real quick just to show you guys. What do you think I should be adding to my team? I'm thinking Lawrence Taylor. Lawrence Taylor is definitely the next one for this, so I can prep for his Ultimate Legend one. Maybe I need a new lineman. I want Mike Allstott. And defensively, there's nowhere to improve, really. I mean, Lawrence Taylor here, and then... Maybe I'm going to upgrade to Marcus Ware and then power up Champ Bailey. But that's about it from that standpoint now. Anyone know how to get Deion Sanders to 90, uh, 99 overall? Because it's just not happening and I don't know why. Alright, second. Comment down below what you guys want to see on the channel. So I already got the sniping series. Should I make a Connect the Franchise series where I rebuild a team? Should I do a Giants theme team or a theme team on Madden Ultimate Team? Such as a Chiefs theme team or something or a Giants theme team? Should I start doing like challenges online? Should I start doing more gameplays? You guys let me know what you guys want to see down below in the comment section below or on Twitter, DM me. Also, I, I also said to people, like, maybe I can start doing some 2K on the channel too. NBA 2K, start off the budget squad. At this point in the year, I haven't played it yet, so start off now and just do a budget squad for people. I feel like that would have been cool, but no one's really for it. I guess maybe because I'm in a Madden community, so who wants to see 2K? It is what it is. So let me know down below what you guys want to see. Any idea, anything, I will listen. I will, I will have an open mind, so just let me know. Also, if you haven't already, go drop the sub down below. We're building this still. We're really getting up there. Hopefully, 1,000 subs by July is my goal. I'm going to write it down. That's 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 the goal. In July, 1,000 subs. Hopefully, we could hit it before then. But at the pace we're going, it looks like we could hit it. So that's all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm out. See you guys later.